Hi there, it's Michelle again with Usborne Books and More. And right now I'm gonna show you some of my most favorite parts of Usborne Books, the activity books. So the first thing I'm gonna show you are these white clean books. This one is the first words variety. We have mazes, dots of dots. Um, this first words, it has um, three letter words and that they can trace. It also has numbers. And as they get to the back, then they are going to first try to write the word after the just having the first letter as a hint and then they're going to write the entire word so this is seven dollars and 99 cents there is a marker that comes with it we've actually taken the marker out quite a few times but it keeps sticking so it it seems pretty stable i wouldn't necessarily rip it all the way off because i don't know if it'll stick but if you just pull it up get your marker out and press it back it should be fine so the next one I want to show you is actually um, activity cards and it's a hundred things to do or I'm sorry a hundred things for little children to do on a trip and there are 50 double-sided cards in here there's things like spot the difference um, turn this shape into anything you'd like draw circles around five things you wouldn't find in a toy store I really like that there's multi levels to this so I feel like you could probably have one stack of these cards for several ages. Like there's some cards that my son loves to do. There's some that are maybe a little too tough for my daughter to do. There's some that my daughter likes to do like this, this castle tower. I don't really know that my little boy is so much into castles as my daughter is, um, but they just, they really like it. There's crossword puzzles, mazes, all kinds of fun things. So these are $9.99. They normally come with a marker in the box, but my children have removed it. Um, another tip is that you can actually punch a hole in each of the corners of these and then put them on a ring so that you don't lose them in the car or wherever you are. I feel like they'd be great to maybe have your child play with during a long car ride. There's actually cards in there that say, can you find a truck? Can you find a cow? Whatever. Um, so I think that that's pretty fun. You could also bring them into a restaurant with you while you wait for your food to be ready. The next one is a dot to dot book. This is dot to dot nature. It's $3.99. We have several other dot to dot books. Um, this, I wouldn't necessarily recommend for a preschooler because there are a lot of dots on some of them. Some of them have over 70 dots. Um, there are quite a few dot to dots on each page. So like each, you know, one, two pages has normally around four dot to dots. So it's a pretty good value. This is 100 paper planes to fold and fly. If you look at the beginning, it tells you that on each page you're going to see one of these symbols either red um, blue green or yellow and it tells you what type of plane you're going to make so let's say you're looking through here and you say oh you know I really like this paper so you're gonna rip out this paper and you're gonna look right here there's a green airplane there so you're gonna come back here and it says you're going to make a bug plane with this so if you open this up you will find out how to make a bug plane. So there are a hundred of these in here. There's all kinds of different prints. I have not quite perfected the mirror image in the camera thing, um, or reverse mirror image, I guess. So this is $7.99. We actually have another one too. So if you go through all those, you can order another book um, with different planes. Um, so this one is the Usborne book of drawing, doodling, and coloring. I feel like this is great for all ages, even older kids, maybe even adults. So it gives them some guidelines on some pages, like here, draw some more flowers and some insects. This is uh, doodle eyes, mouth, and teeth on these plants. Draw cars. I think pages like these, I would love to color these in. I just think it looks so fun. I think it'd be a great gift for somebody to give them this and maybe a packet of markers. I mean, markers are on sale now with back to school sales. So it might, I don't know. I just, I think it'd be such a fun gift to give someone. Um, it's $13.99. This my son just got today. So it's still brand new. There's no writing in it. This is the make and create calendar. And on each page, they have the top picture to color. They also, there's two sheets of stickers in here too. And there's things like doctor appointment, bake sale, show and tell, holiday. 
And then there's also the date pages. And so they're gonna go through and they're gonna write the dates. Again, this is great fine motor practice for kids. The stickers and the writing are both excellent developmental activities. So here's some more pages. Now, when you get to the end, there's also this cute little pocket here so they can keep some important things in there if they'd like. So this is $5.99. This is What Shall I Draw? It's $7.99. It breaks down how to draw almost, well, all the things in here are super simple to draw. I am in no way, shape, or form a good drawer at all. Um, this, though, I can follow. There, it starts like this one, a rocket. It starts with a triangle. We can make a triangle. The helicopter starts like an oval. Well, I know how to make an oval. So it's really easy. Um, my daughter is five and she is able to draw a lot of the things in there. She really likes it. We have quite a few of these lots of things to spot at school books, um, or not to spot at school, but we have other lots of things to spot. And so it starts off like a look and find book. So it'll say, spot three differences between the two car paintings. Can you make these letters into a word? And then as you go through, there's also coloring pages, and there's also a ton of stickers to use on the book. So this is $8.99. Um, Usborne has a ton of sticker books. My son just got this today, and he has already put quite a few stickers on there. It is the flag sticker book. Each page, Hey, sorry, my dog is digging at the door, so hopefully you can't hear it. Um, each page has kind of like a, a faint um, flag, and so you go towards the middle and you find the sticker, you put it on. It will also give you the date that the flag was adopted, and there's also a date and place underneath, and that's where you can write if you see the flag. So, um, for example, when we were at Epcot, we saw the China flag, so we could write that we saw it in Florida on whatever date. So I think that that's really cute. It's $8.99. It's pretty big. I mean, look at the size of that. We also have several Sticker Dolly books. So this is Sticker Dolly Princesses and Sticker Dolly Weddings. Same sort of concept. Um, the only difference is, is that these are kind of like, think paper dolls. See how they have just their underclothes on? You go towards the middle and you find the sticker page with that page on there. So for example, this the page I just showed you is pages two and three. Here are the clothes that they wear because they are going window shopping. She's looking for her wedding dress. So it's really cute. These are also $8.99. We have a ton of other varieties of these. We also have several that are geared more towards boys. Um, for example, there's soldiers, there are uh, heroes. We even have some Shakespeare ones, which I think is pretty cool. Um, this is super cute. It has a little handle on it. It actually has four mini sticker books. It has less pages, less stickers, um, but they're really cute. So this is a sports one. We have a knights one, pirates, and soldiers. And what I really like about these is that they're educational. So for example, here's American Civil War. It tells you a little bit about the war, and then it shows you the um, uniforms that they would have worn. I also have one here. Oh, it was $19.99. This is also $19.99. And as you can see, it is significantly more pink. There are dolls, there are ballerinas, fairies, and princesses. And um, again, they're a smaller form, but wouldn't this be a great thing to take in a car ride or maybe to church or someplace that you just need to take an activity that's easy to clean up? These are super easy to clean up. You just pick up the four books, throw them in there, and you're done. So I really hope that you saw some things that you really like. I hope that you enjoyed the videos. I hope that you'll let me know if you have any questions, and I look forward to talking to you. Bye.